Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. And I'm hoping that you have a happy and healthy and prosperous New Year. And today, I've just been, the last few days up to the New Year leading up to, I've just been going through bags of stuff that I've had from prior uh, beauty cons, beauty conventions, and just pulling out stuff that I haven't even used. And it's just been amazing. It's just been blowing my mind that this has happened. Like I have stuff from, oh, I don't know, from a Pixie sitting in here, from CoverGirl, um, and even some stuff from Besame. What? For example, I found this lovely little box, a tin box, and I'm like, oh, from Mute Sticks, what's in here? And it turns out, it looks like this little thing right here. I just wanted to show this too. It has a mirror inside, which is amazing. But then I wanted to show this part. This is actually a sharpener. Isn't that amazing? I love it. Lip cheek, and this is the eye color. I'm gonna show you the color range there. <laughs> Came off quite easy, considering. And that's what the pencil looks like. I think, oh, it goes on quite smooth. And I don't know why I'm looking on there when I can just as easily look at the mirror that's in here. Okay. It goes on quite comfortably, very creamy. The color is a little light for me. You can see that, oh, mm-hmm. But it's a little light for me. Just wanna show what it looks like here real quick. Very creamy. It's beautiful, actually. And this, I can also use as a blush. That, I'm like, okay. So I'm just gonna put a little here and a little there. <laughs> that looks so strange. Okay, so I'm just doing that real quick. And I'm going to use my e.l.f. small tapered brush and I'm just going to do this. I'd probably do it with my hand too. Let's see if we do it with my hand. It's quite creamy, my goodness. Okay. And that's, I like the finish here too. It's like softer, like this is still kind of strong. So let me just go in here and Okay, and that's, it has like a lipsticky smell. I don't know if that, that makes sense to anybody. So I'm just gonna, again, I, sorry about that. I'm just gonna go in and do this. And I'm not using any um, primer because this stuff is so creamy. I don't think I need a primer. And there is pigmentation on this. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. I guess I could blend it. It's like a cream eyeshadow. So anybody who's into creams will probably love this. It's very forgiving on the lids. I don't feel it tugging or pulling at all. So let's see, I can use, oh yeah, this looks very nice. And then I just, just do it carefully because you don't want to lift all the color off. You just want to smudge it out. And I could totally see this. Oh yeah, I could totally see this like to smudge with. It almost feels like I'm putting on a lipstick on my eyes. But they say this is meant for the eyes. This is an eyeshadow. Oh 
my goodness, that is pretty. And then I'm gonna go under, because it's so easy to do. Oh my, that is so nice. Look at that. So nice. And again, it sort of has that lipsticky without the scent or any kind of fragrance to it. Look at that. I could probably smudge it out some more using a more stiffer brush, but I like it as is. That is really nice, really pretty. Very good job, Nude Sticks, I have to say. And just with those two right there, my face is done. They both feel tremendous and wonderful on the on the skin. It feels incredible. I am loving these colors. And these are the colors anyway that are on right now, which are basically the browns. And this kind of looks peachy to me, but it's on the brown side. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm gonna touch my lips real quick to see if it transfers. And it does, so just keep that in mind. But I feel like putting a topper on it for some reason. Do I have like a topper in any case? I might. Maybe I should try something from Pixie. Oh, excuse me. All right, so let's see. I haven't opened this in a bit, so I'm gonna see how it looks. Oh, it's safe to say it looks like a ooh, you see all that glitter on there what ooh, that looks so pretty let's see how it looks on here you see that oh wow that is gorgeous I feel like putting some on here or should I put some on the lid I'm a little scared but I'm gonna try it let's see This is definitely a night look. I am definitely gonna save this for a night look. This is incredible. I need to get a pose for this. But they say you can also put this on your lips too. I'm like kind of afraid. Should I put it on my lips? Why not? And I'm just gonna dab that on there like so. Oh my goodness, look at that. And that's only on my bottom lip. I'm gonna need to put more on the top, but the top is the matte and the bottom is with that topper from Pixie. I'm like, my God. And I just had this sitting in a, in a bag. Like, what was I doing? So here I am just sitting, talking to you, shooting the breeze. And I just got myself a cute new look, all in like coppers and browns. And it's so, it's just so grand. It's so grand. I'm just moving that around a little bit. <laughs> and it looks incredible. Again, just wanted to put the advice that if you use this uh, Pixie Liquid Fairy Lights, it has big sparkles bits in it, so just be careful because when you have to wipe this stuff off, which I just did, it's gonna be everywhere. I mean, I, when I even tested on my hand, I still have some sprinkles left 
glitter left on my hand, so it's on my uh, makeup eraser, so I'm gonna have to wash that separately. I'm just mindful of the fact because I use, um, as you may or may not know if you follow my channel, I've been using the Best Make Cold Cream, which helps to remove my makeup and leave my skin looking really glowy and pretty. Um, I use a washcloth, or in this case, a makeup eraser to remove it, and I just had to be careful when I was you know, moving the cold cream around to release the makeup and I noticed that the sparkles were just going everywhere. So just please be careful if you still have these. I don't know if they're still on the market, but if they are, just letting you know. Bring in there for Jimmy. <laughs> Liquid Fairy Lights in Passion Light. I have to say, oh my gosh. Wow. It's on my eyelids. And it's on my lips and it's fantastic. I'm so glad that I got a hold of this. I think I was just trying different products at their counter and I bought it and for some reason contents must have shifted and I just didn't come across it until now. I'm so thrilled and now I'm cleaning out stuff and with moving stuff around I'm able to see some of the stuff that I thought I had or I forgot I had and now I'm able to try it. I'm so delighted. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this interesting look from Nude Sticks and Pixie. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, hit that like button and you better hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you will know my next video will be up. I think I'll be posting more videos on makeup I found that hasn't been touched yet. I think I just got myself a new series for 2021. Take care and have a great new year. Happy, healthy, and prosperous to all. Stay safe. Take care. Bye.